Oh, hi. Tim here at the Yet To Be Named Pub with another edition of Pub Talks. You know, a lot of people have been asking me, where did you get your art training? And because uh, you know, I got all these paintings up all the time, like this is one of the uh, the Rat Pack, Peter uh, Lawford. Uh, another one that I did. These are all available on uh, funartstudio.com, by the way. This I paint a lot to uh, jazz, and this one is what I call Dockside. Just just a riff on jazz uh, song that I was listening to when I was painting it. So. Uh, kind of an abstract deal. Yeah, absolutely abstract. Uh, this one's called Verdant, and that was uh, one of my mom's favorites. She's passed now, so the, this comes back into my collection, which means it can be in your collection if you want it, so let me know about that. Uh, but a lot of people ask me, where did you get your art training? Well, I credit educational television. And one guy that I really loved to watch was Jan Yinkelheimer. And I found one of his episodes right here, and I'm going to show it to you right now. Maybe you'll be inspired to become an artist. This is Painting with Jan. And now, here's your host, Jan Yinkelheimer. Hello, and welcome to Painting with Jan. I'm Jan Yinkelheimer, your host, and today we're going to be painting wildlife. First thing you have to do, unless you're out actually looking at the wildlife, is find some reference material. Okay, I found some reference material on a wild turkey on this bottle of wild turkey. I am a method painter, and because I'm a method painter, I like to become my subject. Okay, now what we're going to do is first we have to get our paints out. We call this setting the palette. At least that's what I call it. Okay, now we're going to start out with the sky because we always want to start with the what's in the background, okay? So, oh, oh my god. That went down too quickly. Okay, with a little bit more inspiration. We're getting into the subject matter. Okay, think quickly, think quickly. No reason for slow people in painting. With a little bit of white. Okay, put that white. Oh, huh? Right there. You gotta make sure your drink is not sitting underneath the paint. It splatters down and you don't want to drink the paint. Yeah, paint is only good on canvas. And there are always secret hints from Jan the painter. Take it. That spits the painting with the inspiration juice. And then it's smear it around. Smear it around. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Oh. The field is loaded up onto the paintbrush, and we're going to wander out into the field. The hay field that the farmers just took their tractors out in. I'm going to show you how to put the colors into the stalks. The stalk. The stalks in, in, never mind. Pretend there's a wind coming. Pretend there's a wind coming in the, the direction and blowing. Blah. Now it's time to spit it up again. We're gonna spit it up. I put a little bit too much spit juice in it. And it was raining that. But there's a nice technical thing. I don't call it back in the, and do you know, that the way I live. Okay. Now. I did a model from the, the wild turkey from the body of reference. So we're going to put it on the right here. This is a method you might have used in school. I'm going to put my hand down there and put it around like that. Okay, now there it is. There's a beautiful turkey. I want you to take it coming out of my hand. Look at it. He's got a waggle. And the, the turkey waggle. Yes, so we're going to put the turkey waggle in there. In the tray. You can do that with a pain of fingers to win it. Put it in a turkey wagon. Uh, oh, he is now a turkey. But there's uh, other colors in the background. 
So we have a boozer snitch like that, and there's your wild turkey. Now it's time to refine the pairing. You see, I got the basic essence of the wild turkey in the landscape for the background. Painting into it to define and bring it. Look at how the bread just brought out the feathers there. Oh, it's lovely. And put it in, in the white down here to make the legs skinnier. Look at that. This, don't, don't leave the water. Don't touch the water. Don't touch the water. Don't touch the water. Don't touch the water. Touch the water. There we go. Oh, that is lovely. Oh. Then paint into it again so it's right there because it's always right where, right where you left it. Before, when you paint it into it, that's where it is. But we're running out of time. Remember next time, the journalist is a p painting a portrait of old granddad. This has been Painting with Jan, with your host, Master Painter Jan Yinkelheimer. Join us next time. Until then, happy painting. Okay, you know, questionable uh, integrity and questionable artist, but nevertheless, he wasn't afraid to experiment and uh, use the inspiration juice, which actually I'm using uh, lemon sparkling water <laughs> today, but I might go over and paint a painting. Who knows? Uh, so anyway, um, this is Tim. Thanks for joining us at Pub Talk, and I'll see you next time. Pub Talks has been brought to you by FunArtStudio.com, Fun Art for Home and Business, and by A Major Chub from the Grant Foundation.